Maptitude offers a number of options for customizing your map legends. The first thing you can do is use the pointer tool on the drawing toolbar to drag the legend anywhere in the map window. You can further modify the legend by right-clicking on it and choosing Properties, or double-click on the legend with the pointer tool. On the General tab, you can add a title or footnote, choose the number of columns, choose a scale bar, or choose none from the top of the list to exclude the scale bar from the legend, and choose a background style for the legend. Click Apply to see the changes to the legend. The legend contains a section for layers, a section for feature display settings, a section for selection sets, and a section for themes. You can show or hide an entire section by checking or unchecking a box. You can hide individual items and section titles by choosing them and clicking the Hide button. You can edit the text for any item in a legend. Simply highlight an item and change the text in the box down here. You can also rearrange the items in a legend by highlighting items and clicking Move Up or Move Down. For example, I can rearrange the theme items like this to show the theme in decreasing order. Use the Fonts tab to change the font, size, style, and color of legend sections. Finally, if you do not want the legend to obscure any portion of the map, you can go back to the General tab and choose the Separate Window option. Mattitude now displays the legend in a separate window that I can move off of the map window. And that wraps up this tutorial on customizing Maptitude map legends.